Washington, D.C. If a scandal is about to break, this is the woman who will make it disappear. So Kerry, you are in the new show, Scandal, and mm -hmm. the title itself makes me want to tune in. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, people are drawn to that word. I play a character named Olivia Pope, and Olivia is at the center of a firm named Pope and & Associates, and we're crisis managers, so when people are in a situation, like God forbid, if you found yourself in a situation that you didn't want the media to find out about, that you didn't want the police to know about, that you never wanted to make it to the court system, uh -oh, yes. something, yes, yes, exactly. <laughs> something that seemed like completely unfixable, you would come to us and we would help you. We're lawyers, but this is not a law firm. We can make the problems with our client big or small go away. Well, this show is inspired by a real woman named Judy Smith, and she runs a crisis management firm in Washington, and she has worked with everybody from Monica Lewinsky to Michael Vick. It's not specifically about any of her clients, but the writers would kind of create these massively scandalous situations and they'd go to Judy and say, what would you do? How would you fix it? Your character's pretty interesting because she, on a professional level, she's totally on point, mm -hmm, right? Mm -hmm. Personal level, it's a little different. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's really fun for me. I mean, one of the things that drew me to this character is that very contradiction that I think a lot of modern women can relate to, that you could have one area of your life that you've totally figured out, you know, but then in her personal life, she's confused and vulnerable and torn in lots of different directions. What's also interesting about this show is with a, a lot of TV shows, you see the good guy winning, right? Mm. It's the fight for the good guy, but with this show, is there really a good guy? <laughs> well, that's what I mean. I love Shonda Rhimes. She's the writer and creator of the show. When you watch the first episode, by the end of the season, nobody is who you think they are. Even the people who work at Pope and Associates, we all have our own personal experience with scandal. So that's part of why when somebody walks into the office on the worst day of their lives, we all have a level of compassion. If Olivia Pope fixes things, that's who she is. You need fixing. Everyone in this office needs fixing. Perry, good luck with the new show. Thank you, thank, thank, thank you so it. much. I hope you enjoy it. Yes, well, I love the trailer, so <laughs> I can't you. wait to see it. Thank you, Thanks. stay scandalous. Scandalous. <laughs> <laughs>